It's 10 a.m. I look outside of my window. What do I see? The brilliantly bright sun piercing not only through the cloudy sky, but through the uncertainty of my day. The fresh breeze, accompanied only by rain, a scent no one here is accustomed to, but welcomes always. It is at this hour that only big brain genius indie game developers decide to release a horror game. Because I mean, who could ever be busy at 10 a.m. on a Tuesday? It's unheard of. Who, who, a job? Are you, what? I'm a little upset, okay? This game was supposed to come out 10 hours ago at midnight. I bought a pizza, I got some sodas, Mirror Forge is coming out. Been looking forward to this for a year. And then they were like, oh no, 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 10 a.m. <laughs> cool. <laughs> All right, whatever. If you're asking what is Mirror Forge, I don't know. I know it's a horror puzzle game, but beyond that, I have no, no clue. I didn't even play the demo and, uh, or maybe I did. I don't know, I have like 400 videos. It's hard to remember what I've done and haven't done, but I don't think I have. I think I might be confusing this game with Mirror Layers and that's a totally different game that is also a horror puzzle game. Whatever. We're playing this. I hope you guys are doing great. It's also going to be long. It's going to have puzzles. I'm an idiot. I'm fucking stupid sometimes. So I hope you're not staring at the screen going, dude, it's right there. It's always the same dream. Blinding light. Don't copy me. A cold umbral growl. I'm reaching, clawing towards hope. Towards oblivion. Positively spooky. Pain. Real spiked thunder drove straight through my palm. My heart keeps beating. I stumble. Grasp out in delirium. Then, black. I dream about my mistakes. About the life I destroyed. All I have left is my scar. To remind me of the things I've done. Looks pretty fucking cool. <sighs> Just another day in. One day at a time. That's what you I keep this. telling myself. I'm like, ugh, another day at work. I, whoa! What did I do? Even two years after the accident, I'm still getting these migraines. Feels like someone's trying to claw right into my skull. I think I left my painkillers in the nightstand. Are you asking or telling me? And also, why doesn't my mouse work? Uh. Hello. Controls. It feels like this should work. Uh, uh okay, all right. Not a good sign. Uh, let's see if we can fix this somehow. What can I do about this? Feels like someone's trying to claw right into my skull. I think I left my painkillers in the nightstand. This game is made with horror engine. A free template from the Unreal Engine Marketplace. Why doesn't my mouse work? What is this? Hit all buttons. I just muted myself on Discord. Options. Let's go from windowed or full screen to windowed. It works. Boom. You know, it's just when you're an Unreal Engine fucking mastermind and you've dealt with all the stupid things of that engine, you just know how shit works. It's it's like insanity, but I don't know how else, how else to explain that. Ugh, whatever. We're in it. We can play this game now. These are my painkillers. We'll take them. You got a couple pills in there, buddy. Ugh. <sighs> Not perfect, but better. Good enough to get me through the next few hours at least. If you're wondering how I know this is a horror game template from the marketplace. Is that my landline? I'd forgotten I even had it connected. Just look it up. You'll see this HUD, and it'll become very apparent to you. 
There's nothing wrong with that. We've played a lot of horror engine games on this channel, including Summer of 58, Father's Day, uh, a lot. That's all you need to know. We've played a lot of those. So I guess this is the office room. I don't feel like sitting in front of a laptop right now. At this hour? No, no, no. We do all our work at 10 a.m. Nope. That's my restroom. That is the most obnoxious telephone in human history. Hello? Good morning to you too, Dell. Morning? Why are you calling my landline? Oh, I tried calling the cell first, but it just kept going to voicemail. Aren't you supposed to leave that bad boy on in case there's a plane crash or something? Not anymore. Hey, you may have lost your license, but you've got a gift, man. Fixing knees and backs is easy. It's me I don't know how to fix. Oh, Jesus. How long you kept that one in your back pocket? Dale, you're right. I'm not feeling any better sitting here. I'll swing by the ranch tonight, yeah? And thanks. I'd forgotten my amnesia versary was coming up. Well, that's why you got me to remember for you. <laughs> yeah, Dale remembers it so you don't have to. This morning is just full of surprises. Dale Walker. If you get that joke. You're my favorite. Damn. Okay. Amnesia bursary. That's not a good sign. Hello? I could swear I've seen this symbol somewhere before. Who could have sent this? It said press control. Left control. So that's what I did. This is a waste of cardboard. Should we maybe take this inside first? Thomas, I know you and Jill are separated, lol. But you are still her emergency contact. The footage was transmitted to my computer last night. I couldn't make heads or tails of it, and I figured you'd want to know. Jack Crane, EIC of Ajax News. Written in fucking blue crayon. I can't believe it. USB drive, I wonder what's on it. Uh-huh. Okay. I don't feel like sitting in front of my laptop. <laughs> Game ends. It's one of the endings, actually. That's a cool reflection. It's not real, but... Clean tooth toothpaste. My stock of extra migraine meds been having to use it more and more lately. And we don't want to take any of that. What is that? Oh, that's a dog with a pipe in its mouth? It's scuba. <laughs> I hate myself for making that joke. Don't worry. It's it's like you don't even get it. You don't even get it. It doesn't matter. My old wallet, aside from the clothes on my back, this was all I had on me when I woke up in that field 20 years ago. Got too ratty a long time ago, but I keep it around as a memento. I'll take it. I need a new wallet, actually. Been looking for one. People keep telling me to get one of those metal ones, but I hate the sound it makes when it rubs on anything, so no. Is, is the camera working? All right, looks like it. <clears throat> All right. Good evening. I'm Jill Lane reporting for AOC News Live from Devil's <laughs> Womb Canyon. Breaking news as authorities report that three buses full of students have disappeared without a trace. The school group was returning from their annual class trip to Camp Watonic when parents... Shit. Is everything just breaking today? I think I still have one of my old work computers in the storage closet. Why would this be an issue with the computer? Come on, Thomas. 
You don't know how USB drives work? You have to copy the file over, dude. Don't play it from the actual flash drive. Flashlight? Hell yeah. Oh, thank God. It's like a good one, too. If you see this icon, it means the object is physics-based and you can grab it. Press my right mouse button or gamepad. Yeah, that, that's not, that doesn't pertain to us. Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna rotate this so I could read it. Blu-ray player. What? Is, this must be where our computer is. Um, did I find it? Was that the computer? Is my mission successful? We have a bit of a black mold problem in here, don't we? Um. Wow. Yeah. No, this is bad. I fucking knew it. What in the fuck? I can't throw it at her. Journal updated. Tab to check. Explore the strange reality. <laughs> I'm sorry. Don't you think it's a bit too early to be here in Silent Hill 3? It does look pretty cool, though. But it's a bit explicit, isn't it? I don't know. Damn it, dude. Viruses are some real shit in this day and age. Look what that flash drive did to us. I want to go see this monster. Holy shit. You carry a heavy burden, my friend. Alright, this seems like the way to go. So I don't want to go this way. I want to see what's over here. Oh, they boarded the door. I feel like I could poke one of your eyes and you'd be really upset. Like, you might actually scream for help because there's nothing stopping me from doing it. You did swallow what looks like a firefighter, though. Alright. Thumbnail! Sorry. That's usually a joke, but in that case, it might actually be true. Oh, boy. Oh yeah, Choo Choo Charles is coming out in three days. This week is just kind of crazy, huh? There's a... Excuse me, there's a lot of big releases. What the fuck was that? Okay. Press space or gamepad face button bottom to jump. The electronic door closed before I could reach it. I need to grab the key I left in the storage room and proceed to monitoring the pull... To pull the lever and open it once again. Wait, what? So we need a key in the storage room? Which is probably here, huh? Dreams make that of my designs. Rejected curve. Slither on your belly to me and grovel. Your insignificance amuses me. Sounds like my ex-girlfriend. You weren't that much better than me. Oh, I don't I, I don't trust this one. <laughs> I don't trust this window, I'm gonna be real with you. First I'll read the note. Uh Doctor, get this tutorial away from my screen. I already jumped. There. 
Dr. Jane Smith, Chief, Chief Dimensional Physicist Project Mirror Forge. To say the initial results of the forge's ac activation were unexpected would be an understatement along the lines of calling penicillin just some mold. We, would, we thought we would find new elements, new sources of infinite energy, and yet we found so, so much more. The experimental potential of these new vistas are unprecedented, as is the danger. This thing doesn't just make a window between realities, it cracks it. Okay, a key, a door key by the size of it. Get away from the window. Dude, I'm, look, I'll walk up to it, okay? We can do this together. Oh, I'm fucking... I'm flabbergasted. Okay. I'm shocked that nothing... Why is there no audio in this game? Sorry, I went from one thought to the next, like, immediately. Oh, it's the door to that? No, I want to go back. I didn't know this was the right way to go. It's Callisto Protocol all over again. <clears throat> ah. This is Joe Lane speaking to Dr. Thomas Jackson, surgeon and lead physician for the Hope Project. First question, how do you do it? 14 hour days, six days a week? You get used to the hours and a medically unsafe quantity of coffee. <laughs> that may be true, but you see so much suffering. How do you handle it? Someone has to. How noble, Mr. Superman. It's Dr. Superman, oh, thank you. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> but please, just call me Thomas. That's us? Oh, it may, uh, duh, Jill and Thomas. We're that guy? Damn, Thomas, you spit in some game. Thomas, leave, leave some of the babes to the rest of us. What are you doing? I like this image here. It's like it's holding the TV. It's honestly kind of cute. See it, right? Like, this is the hand right here. Two eyes, mouth. I'm sorry, I had to kill you. Uh, Where does that lead to? I guess we follow the yellow cable. What does that say? I feel cold, angry, alone, forever twitching at the in-between. Hmm. Okay. My words are shiny trinkets. Bubbles of power and promise so easily purchase your pathetic imaginations. You are worthy of such privilege to hear whispers from a god. You're a god? Quite a weak god, isn't it? Like, imagine a god who cares about what anybody else is doing. Did you just buy a fucking computer, you consumer? Am I running from this? Bring it back to me. Oh, I am. Not yours. You're not taking my stuff. The fuck is this place? Oh, this is the Mirror Forge. Uh, the, the flashlight is sometimes too bright, I think. Diary of Jacob Earl Earldred, August 10th, 1994. Ten years, $150 million, and six excavators. This was the price. Had I known it would cost so much, would I have paid for it so gladly? Obsession is an insidious killer, and I know of no other honest way to describe my search. Today, they found it. Locked away in a tomb made of star stone, a cosmic cage to contain the power of the gods. The Anunnaki. I hope I said that right. The seal of Nur 
is the final terrestrial vessel of their vast influence. With it, I can break the very laws of our reality, push down the walls of existence. Problems thought insurmountable will be child's play. Infinite energy, immortality, world peace. All we'd have to do is will it to be so. Yeah, I'm sure it's that easy. Uh, there's an audio recorder there. I'll grab the key first. An old key. And how are the gravitation readings? Mm -hmm. Any promising leads? Jacob, fuck the gravitation readings. Four people, my friends, are dead. <sighs> yes. I know. Don't think for a second that doesn't haunt me. But if we turn back now, we'll move for nothing. <laughs> And if we keep going, how many more will die? Not if I can help it. The second activation won't be like the first. I'm taking precautions. Speak of the devil. I invited the team of the medical doctor. I need you two to work together to make sure that this does not happen again. Yeah, I'm sure Jacob cares a lot. It haunted me. <laughs> I assure you, it hurt very much. Yeah, the volumetric lighting on the light specifically is a little too much. It almost looks like fog. This is the default horror engine footstep sound. What the fuck did I just walk into? just looped. Steel of Nur. I have no idea what this artifact is. I'll take it. Press 1 or gamepad face button top to equip the Seal of Nur. Oh, an achievement unlocked, but I couldn't read it. So it came to pass that Nur did lay his beating heart within a vessel. The seal of Nur, forged so those few marked may pass as did Nur between the glass of living and dead, to call back those that have since gone, to walk through the veil between waking worlds, and to cast back those that do not belong. So this is what the artifact of Noor does. It just brings back memories or projects you. What the fuck? What do I do with this? Oh, I restrain the dummy. Okay, but like he's in the way, isn't he? Go away, dude. Now he's over here. Okay, well, I gotta fucking find a way to get away from him. I'm hoping he walks away. Maybe I'm supposed to be caught by him? I don't know. Yeah, here we go. I- dude, no, I know. Ow! Are you busy right now? Can I interest you in a tutorial that- that'll get you hit? Absolutely. What do I need? What is this? Achievement unlocked. Down the what rabbit hole. the fuck was all of that? That wasn't a dream. Check the source of beeping. 
Ah, oh, that's too strong. Laptop. Phone? My cell phone, it's completely dead, won't even turn on. It was working fine last night. Fucking planned obsolescence bullshit. I mean, when you spin it like that, dude, it's gonna break. Is it more of the video? Hopefully. It's Ow. Report that suddenly all calls and messages coming from the children inside stopped at the same time. The police have not been able to locate any brake marks or signs of collision along the road. With only the town of Gorberg nearby, options are limited for. Oh, God. Shit! Jill! What in the <gasps> is going on? Golden Roosters, fathomless desire, power without measure. Paltry words to sway a lesser man. My patience wears thin. You took from me. And now, I have taken from you. Follow her path. The doorway will be open to you. Return her to me, and I shall return her to you. Jill, I don't know what's happening. This is insane. But it doesn't matter. I'm coming. Uh, Thomas? <laughs> you might want to consider that. Oh! I thought I did that by opening the menu. Uh, get the car key from the table in the living room. I would like to close this. No fucking way I just broke this game. I cannot... Oh my god, how do I do it? Okay, it's okay. Maybe I can grab the car keys from the table and fix this. Where's my table? Where's the, where's the kitchen? Oh, okay. It had to be this way. Yeah, here we go. Okay. I can't believe this is working. Game saved. Oh, good, 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 good. Alright. Woo! Game is a little buggy. A little bit. Somewhere in Devil's Womb Canyon. Because of course it would be called that. I was going to say you should slow down. I think this game is uh, actually quite technically amazing. Despite its use of uh, the horror engine. Gotta try and find someone. Okay. Okay, Thomas. Get that off my screen. Explore the surroundings. Roger that. But yeah, as I was saying... <clears throat> um... This game is technically pretty, pretty cool. And the reason I say that is because... These are painkillers? Just in the rain? God abandoned us. This is not the same time, is it? We, like, went back in time or some shit. What is that? Equip the Seal of Nur and use it on the light particles to reveal a frozen moment. Oh, a map? Hold on, hold on, one thing at a time. Notes. Child drawing. I wonder what made the kid draw such eerie drawings. 
The kid that drawn this must have been traumatized. This doesn't look like anything. It's like a car crash. You should have seen the stick drawings I used to make as a kid. Like hand grenades, blown up people. And I used to do it in class. Why can't I grab this? Okay. Throw? Place the lever on the power box and turn it on. Oh, okay. Yeah. I thought that. Wrote it down. And now I'm gonna do it. First, I'll take this map, though. Map of the Gorberg Industrial Zone. So, where are we at? Whatever. We're probably in uh, family housing, if I had to guess. The top left one. Why? Why? If, she, if the demon god or whatever wants me to come this way, why would she send demon assassins to get me? Looks like he got trapped in that webbing. I'd better stay away from it. I'd better do some crazy puzzling. Or sorry, platforming. Or maybe... I fucking... If that was the intended path... I... I don't even know. Like, that's just odd. Eh. Oh, I think I know what I need that for. Okay. I need it so that I could climb over this. Yeah. Okay. Well, okay. <laughs> All right. Theory confirmed. But, ah, shit. I was gonna see if I could get up on top of the buildings. Billionaire News. Jacob Erldred promises new future for renewable energy with Project Mirror Forge. Isn't he the guy who invented some banking app? Banking app. The back is blurry, but this is a newspaper in 1999. And Project Mirror Forge? Why would you just outright say what it is? That doesn't seem like something an evil billionaire would do. Like immediately disclose the source of the infinite energy. Does that make sense? Crystal formation. I have no idea what they use it for. The camera's not working again. Great. All right. Uh, my science team has found a way to neutralize these strange alien webbings that appeared after the second attempt to turn on the mirror forge. Uh, if, if you get stuck, just follow my lead. First, grab an empty beaker and place it on the hob. Empty beaker on the hob. And now I will go look Good. elsewhere. Now put some sulfur powder inside. I feel like this will open. And then we can do stuff. I don't think I can go down there. Oh. I was looking for this. Hey! It was a giant fucking spider. That's actually kind of scary. That's not sarcastic either. I, I, I can't deal with spiders. They fuck me up real bad. Good. Uh, now put five carbon rods inside. Five carbon rods, you say? Um, here we go.
we go. What is this? Oh, a branch? I'll take the copper wire. Fuck it. Okay, you'll need to place a copper wire now. Next, pour the hydrobromic acid into the beaker. Uh, chemicals this way. Well done. Now, we'll, we'll need to turn on the engine to bring power to the hob. What do you mean, well done? Are you watching me? <laughs> what is this? It's the world's greatest tutorial. Uh, there we go. Now what? Start up the engine. Fire up. Uh, just wait for it to heat up. Okay. Last up, uh, pour the ambient liquid we've extracted from the webbings into the beaker. The alien liquid we've extracted? Where do you keep that at? Oh, are these painkillers? I'll take those. Um. Oh, it's this. Who is out there crying so much? Oh. It's that guy. <gasps> okay. All right, then. Chill out. I'm a little ashamed that that got me, considering I know exactly how this engine works. Whatever. It's fine. There you go. An acid strong enough to burn through anything. Anything, you say? Achievement unlocked. Master Chemist. Looks like that used up all the acid. Well, all right what then. What the hell happened to this town? Whoa, 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 whoa. It's like no one is here. No one? Are you sure, Thomas? No one is here. No one is here. That looks really goofy. Okay, can I open this? Nope, let's go. No time to look around. Game saved. Achievement unlocked, size matters. I feel like I shouldn't be able to hear those footsteps the way I do. Well. What is that thing? <laughs> this must be Kansas. Tornado Whatever Alley. This is. Seems to be getting worse further in town. It's it was literally a tornado alley. Oh fuck. Okay. Um, sure. Where do I go? Can I go under this truck? Whoa, what the? I just, I don't even know what to say anymore. Stay out of the road, I guess. The road is not safe. Okay, we're at the playground. So we actually know where we are now. That's good. But just for a few minutes, we don't have much time. We need to get someplace safe before the creatures start roaming this way again. Hurry up now. Mum, did you just let your kid play on the seesaw while there were fucking monsters out and about? I cannot believe you, Mum. 
That is an incompetent mum. I'm doing something stupid. I don't care. Shit, they didn't let me. Okay, we can't do dumb stuff. Confirmed. No, 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 no. I don't know if I'm supposed to go this way, but it feels like maybe I am. Uh, feet are talons, hands are unclean, face like a savage lion. Okay, so I need talons, hands, and a face in order to unlock whatever this is. Or maybe I could just throw a fucking brick at that window and climb in. That one right there. That is so funny to me. I like, I can't. It's actually Shit. hilarious. That's a lot of blood. And a flashlight. I sure hope there's no monsters in here. How many, uh, we have three painkillers? I feel like I had way more than that. Anybody think so? I feel like I picked up three just in the beginning of the game. Smooth. Okay, so that's the way to go. These military crates are all over the place. What happened here? Two days of waiting. Some of the people have already entered the facility, but my team is still here. What's going on? These Gorberg folk are not the chatty type then. Two. Oh, he died. Okay. So we have a number. That's odd. Could I just be doing this all over the place? Seven. scared me. No, 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 no. That's impossible. It can't be happening again. Painkiller. Does it max out at three? No. Okay. So we definitely need a code. I don't know the code to open it. Oh, okay. Do I need to, like, stare at these or something? Never forget, never forget, never forget. Diner first, box then follows, women then men. Must not lose it. Ah! Must not lose it. It'll make you forget. Don't forget the code. Just write it down. Okay. Diner first, box then follows. So 2 7, women and men. So I guess we gotta look for representations of men and women or. That was stupid. Candle needs lighter to be lit. Like my presence isn't good enough. Okay. All right. Drawer. Key. Diner storage room key. Oh, nope, not that. So wait, is it woman then man or man then woman? Woman then men. Okay, so two seven. And then now I got to find the other area. Hello. Oh, 
Okay. So let's see. So this is woman. Jill. Does she have a number? Uh, not one that I can see. Whatever. This is Jill's. Hmm, I should take this. I might need it at some point. But I can't take this. What could Jill's number be? Gunshots mean people. What the fuck? I haven't I haven't moved. Um I'm just thinking about what this code might be. <laughs> Let me figure this out. Do I know the code yet? Check the source of shooting behind the diner. Okay. I'll do whatever you ask of me. Let me bust this out just in case. Thank you for that. So let's go women first. got pinned down at the diner. We cannot proceed to the facility. Monsters, cultists, yeah, they're everywhere. We've lost the, two of the prisoners. That's that strange anomaly roaming the streets. The uh, news reporter and the cameraman are still with us. Find me at the end. Ow. Why? What is this? I... I... Fight back. Bro, I know you're not in there. I can see. Wait, is that the number? Three? I don't know what the number is. I don't know if I... I'm looking in the right place, though. It could be five because of the hand. Oh, what's that? Oh, no. Oh, three. Three candles. Maybe? And then there's also the number three right there? I think? man time. Oh, that looks fucking cool. Caution, wet floor. Hmm, I don't know if I trust these tentacles. I feel like they might grab me. Zero. Okay. So I think we can actually just guess. The heck? Oh, did this open up? solution is I don't even have to go that way anymore. I already got the answer. Okay. Never mind. So it's sorry, it's 2770. Metal mask. Find the truth that was. I'll just put that back. 
piece by piece I'll rid your flesh from bones Tear essence from soul Leave from you a thousand fold what was taken I'm confused. Do you want whatever I took back or not? Alright. First thing I'll do, make sure that I can't skip the whole game. Alright. Game saved. Can I hide under this? I can, okay. <laughs> That's good to know. This is like one of those God of War chests that you like open up and you get XP. I don't know if that's in the new games. Twelve more fucking people. We flipped the switch and people die. I don't even give a shit about the science anymore. This is madness. Jacob is already talking about a third activation. I I can't let that happen. I'll need to get the doctor on my side for this. He can still get through to Jacob. And maybe... Maybe we can stop this. Aren't you a news reporter? Isn't it your job to report on this? Just do your job. It's like maybe the doctor can stop them. It's like no, you could you could just upload one YouTube video, just upload some documents, send it to the U.S. government, unless they're in on it, then don't do that. But either way, you can definitely do something. There's a snake in this Voss. This guy has a really short stride. Oh. Okay. This game is, uh, visually semi-interesting, but, like, the audio is just missing. Like, the humming is not enough, I feel like, for such an epic fucking... I don't even know, I guess it's a temple or something, but... I feel like an underground temple would have a lot of, like... I don't know, plates moving underground and you could hear rocks and, I don't know, bats or something. Fuck. Oh, there's the, there's the mark on my arm or hand, whatever. So we need four, five, six. Each of these statues has Roman numerals on them. Maybe they mean something. I'll keep this short. Morale among the staff is wavering. I feel that many lack the resolve to see this through. We cannot fail this close to the finish line. I know you share my vision. Suffering, loss, famine, inches from a footnote in the history books. I need you. Your weekly medical exams have granted you a closeness to the team that I no longer have. I need you to monitor them. Make sure they stay the course. The entire project is in your hands. Earl Dread. So this is Jacob, writing a note to the doctor that he, I guess, trusts more than I thought he would. And, uh, basically saying stuff. Okay, so... There's numbers assigned to the symbols. Is there anything assigned to these? 
uh, rotate. Okay, I see that. That's the the one right there on the chest, right? Okay, so one goes to the horse, which is right here. Hope that's how that works. Um, and uh, let's try this one. What is what is this? This one is two. What does two go to? Uh, this one over here. I hope it's okay that I'm just dropping them like that. And this one, what? Okay, this is three. Three goes to the fucking spaceship. I don't even know what to call that. Uh, that one is right here. At least they're all in order. So this is probably four, yep. Four goes to this. This is five, right? Yep, five goes to the eyelid thing. That's this thing right there. And this one can only go to the diamond. Oh, Jesus fucking Christ, man. of a bitch. Oh, I can go home. Who carried this? Oh, we did good. You don't want to fight me. I cannot help you while its influence is strong. Destroy its markers and... The strange figurines, destroy them, so I can plunge into your reality. Hey! Who are you? What the fuck do you want? Well, I'm sure it's a good guy if it's... if it wants to enter our world. Destroy the statues to empower the chains of the Seal of Noor. Corrupted figurines. Okay. I guess I'll destroy... I mean, isn't this one of them? That voice. Where have I... That. Oh, okay. So it's two seven three zero. The last digit. I should try the code on the safe in the diner's office. Maybe I'll find some info on where they took Jill. Hmm. Mirror Forge. Just, uh. I don't know. Just seems like a standard game. Ah, fuck. I didn't mean to do that. Oh, wait. I hit two, right? That's right. Two, seven, three, zero. That easy. Is oh. this what that voice was talking about? Doesn't look like much. No idea what'll actually happen if I break it. Destroy the statue or continue towards the small house in the north. You son of a bitch. How dare you? How dare you tell me of the branching path after I fucking destroy the statue? You son of a bitch. Then I have to head towards the small house in the north. Where am I? I'm in the diner. The small house in the north would be, what, the family housing up there? Or the barracks. In the north. Okay. Well, let's go. What was that? 
It was coming from that small house just after the playground. This is north? I fucking beg to differ. Whatever. Oh, it's a thing. Yeah, come get me. Yeah, looking real stupid. Small house to the north. Hey, they lied to me. There's no house anywhere here. Is it in the playground? Not that. Ah, here we go. I found it. Like, do you get what I'm saying, right? This game just feels too quiet. It's really, it's not quiet in the volume sense, but in like the atmosphere. It feels empty. An ancient book. What is known is that it was here before. It came in the old days, sometime before 3500 BC. There is no reasoning with it. Its intentions are cosmic, purified hunger. The god does not care about the gnats that dance around its meal. With swords of madness, famine, and plague, it bent the world to its knees, and when the forests were burned and all hope turned to black, it slew children and stole unborns to rob them of a future. How it was banished is unknown, but the cage which binds it is always one crack from spilling the darkness back into our world. Achievement unlocked. Tales of old. It's stuck. Painkillers. I will never say no to painkillers. I'm a medical professional, after all. Sure, you could have some. You could have some, too. Take them. What? You prefer narcotics? Absolutely. That's a joke. It's not a good one, though. I'll give you, th I'll give you that one. It's not a good one. And it's probably a bit poor taste as well. Deliver test subjects to Gorberg Facility 2. Is that... Is that the test subject? The cultists? towards the facility where Jill was taken. Now, where is that at exactly? Gorberg facility 2. So it's behind this house, then. Um, sure, I can go there. Yeah. What was I gonna say? I was gonna say something. That's one of the statues we have to break. I swear I had something to say. I don't remember what it was. Game saved. That's not a good sign. Yeah, fucking come get me. Bye bye. Oh, there's more.
Um, okay, so I guess I gotta fire... Fire. Bring power to the keypad, follow the cable connected to it. I was gonna say I gotta follow the cable, but... They just tell you what to do in the puzzle game. Yeah, yeah, sure. Come on over here, buddy. Looking stupid. I, I would love to read that, trust me. Something tells me I don't act. Yeah, see, I don't actually have to follow anything. I just have to do this. On. Use the key card next to the large gate to open it. The key card or the keypad? What's over here? Why can I do this? What am I doing right now? Okay, so I can't get away with that. <laughs> I'm scared, but I'm also really curious. Alright, they, they don't let you go up there, so that's the limitations of that. Okay. A world bound by... Ow! Something. I did it. No, oh, I didn't mean to do that. Okay. So we're inside the facility, I guess. Did the other demon thing mention how many, um, how many, uh, what how many demons here? there are? Or demons. How many statues there are? Find a clue about Jill's whereabouts. Investigate the trail of blood on the floor. Ow. Someone scratched my back. Oh no. It's itchy. My back itches. Oh. That's kind of cool. I'll take that. Probably the key for that door on the other side of the hangar. I mean, the, the door we haven't seen yet. Die, bitch. Achievement unlocked. French fries. Bet I can hit the other switch from here. Oh my god. Okay. It's fucking... It's like a joke, right? So there's another switch somewhere. Um, we gotta pull the lever, right? We don't ha we don't throw this again, do we? Yeah, I thought I thought not. Um, so there's another cable somewhere. No key card. Oh. There we go. This is gonna lead to like a ladder in here or something.
Shipment of antimatter arriving. Highly dangerous. Do not touch the containers until the Fermatomic science team arrives. Check the magnet readings and report immediately. Roger that. E card. From a company called Fermatomic. Fermatomic, the ones that study Fermatomic stuff. Interesting. That is so funny. I. It's just really funny, isn't it? <laughs> I just think. I don't know. I think it is. There's a seesaw in this game. Oh, fuck. You can actually open this? I'd rather go this way. The metal grate seems electronic. The cable probably goes beyond the green door underneath. Okay, so... We would need to... Yeah, I see. So we open this hatch and then and then we can hit that other lever okay it just feels like you could climb the pipe but video game See, this is pretty good. I don't think whispers are scary. Because technically, if they're whispering, that means they're scared of me. Okay, I don't know the code to use it. You do not have a USB in inventory. Okay, so we're looking for a flash drive. There it is. Just uh, just let me access the computer. I don't understand why... If you're just gonna put it in the same room, just fucking put it on the desk. Just be plugged on PC and removed from inventory. Jill Lane, a Furbatomic scientist, did a subatomic analyst on the dimensional traveler who got trapped into our universe once the Mirror Forge exploded. We found her alongside three other people, members of a news team, quote unquote, also originating from the other reality. These people's molecular frequencies and dimensional energy are our only hope of opening a rift between our world and the other. Jill Lane, age 37, origin universe four. What the fuck is going on? So now that we have like inter universal people? I'm assuming that's what it is. Hello? Oh my god. I don't want to fuck with this. I don't get it. Why should I care about this? Uh, is there like a code or something on here? Whatever, let's get out of here. One thing that they can't do to me, I will not allow it, is no spiders. You put spiders, I'm throwing hands. Going right on their Twitter, I'm gonna be like, dude, why? 
But did I even unlock the hatch? No, I didn't. So, investigate the source of the roar in the hallway. Oh, okay. Is this the hallway? Mm, I guess I missed something over here. Is it you? The mirror never sleeps. Is it you guys? Are you the mirror? This seems like a mirror. Never mind. Apparently I don't know the code. And when I come out here, nothing really happens. This is the hallway in question, I'm assuming. This is a door that I can't unlock. That cable leads there. Nothing behind the door. Um, I can cross over to this side. I guess I haven't done this. Oh, look. Wait, what? Oh, do I have to look at this? I do it? What's your fucking deal? What do I... There's no mirror in here, right? Turn it back on. What am I looking at here? So... Um, I don't know. Nothing on this side, nothing on that side, nothing on the shelves. Investigate the source of the roar in the hallway. What is the source of the hallway? In the hallway, what is it? I thought it was this door. What? Oh my god. 6027. Okay. That's the source of the roar in the hallway. I didn't know you could change cameras. <laughs> I did hit both buttons. I don't know what it, what that was about. Shit. 6027. Enter. It says ladder grate control, probably for the grate above the ladders in the hangar. Yeah, hit it. Have I hit it? Go up the broken beams in the hangar and climb the ladder. Yeah. Okay. Achievement unlocked. First time. I fucking missed it, man. I didn't mean to. I thought the scare would be in the other direction for some reason. Um. What does that say? If your wind wimp, we'll figure it out later. We'll figure it out with the magic of editing. I don't want to crouch. There we go. Oh my god, I'm pretty sure I wasn't supposed to go, but I did anyway. That's a fucking gamer move. It uses our darkest thoughts against us. 
reads our minds and warps our reality and perception. Delights in our fear and suffering, breaking us until we have lost all sanity. I wonder what this entity would show me. Like, I wonder if they could look through my brain and be like, Dude, what the fuck? <laughs> this guy's seen some shit. And I don't even mean, like, in real life. I just mean, what can they show me that I haven't already been desensitized to? Are they going to show me a hellish landscape? Like, ooh. I'd be like, wow, this is generic. <laughs> uh, that, that sounds funny. To me, I guess. I don't know. Calling a demon's torture generic. Like, okay, dude. Where, what game did you take this one from? Look for a clue as to what happened. It's not even... I don't even see anything that has happened. I just see, like, a bunch of messed up stuff. We need another code, though. That much is obvious. Game saved. The Mirror Forge. We were wrong. It isn't a door. It's a hammer. It doesn't tear space-time. It smashes the multiverse into one. It starts with dimensional cracks, rifts on the walls, things come through. But what's worse is that voice, a whisper of what's still trapped on the other side. It feeds on our fear, our pain. It uses our memories to warp our reality, your reality. The barrier between the two is so thin now. Brian Clark. A Mirror Forge Specialist. Clark. Where have I heard that name? What is happening to me? Oh no. Is this another amnesia story? That phone next to this corpse is turned on. Invisible monster, listen and survive. Rely on your hearing, not your eyes. Oh no. <clears throat> Anytime there's anything like that, that's bad news. Where's the phone? Okay. We're under attack. Ever since the activation, the instances of hostile breaches... Dude, I'm reading this, man. I'll get to that. ...have reached catastrophic levels. We lost power, and there's something in the dark. I can't see it, but I hear it breathing. Can't get to the reserve power generators. If anyone finds this, the door code is 37. See? If we hadn't read this, we would be fucked. Anyway, what's up? Looks like some sort of energy storage. Oh my god, I see the thing. If I do this, will um Will I catch it? Okay. So the door code is 37, right? That's what he said? Yep. Okay. And we have to restore power. The first numbers were 37. Find the rest of the code. You son of a bitch. Like, I'm gonna do that. Isn't this where I'm supposed to put the code? Okay, 375. Something. I don't think it'll be 1. All right, fine, we'll try it. Fucking told you. Uh. Uh. 
Didn't I just try them all? Am I wrong here? What? I guess we don't know if... We don't know that five is the third number, right? So I guess let's try, like, everything in five. Oh, fuck. Okay. Listen, do not see. What the hell? What is this? I'm gonna leave this shit right there. What is that noise? Okay, so what do we got here? Ah, fuck it. We'll just go. Check the control panel. Now for the battery. I managed to finish the security power system modifications on time. The system now will perform checks on a regular basis. Ensuring that no power storage is plugged in unless the magnetic coils are powered up. Always turn the valve next to the slots before you plug any power storage. Thank you. Okay, so I did it. Plug the other batteries into the energy grid. Did it open this door? Oh, shit. We need to find two more. My question is, do we... do we hide from it, or...? It's like doing a loop. It's in front of me right now. It's to my left. That's kind of close. Oh, fuck. I saw it. Which is really funny considering you're not supposed to hear it or see it, I mean. So fucking good at this game, it's crazy. Go through the open door in the end of the hallway. I'll wait for it to be not in front of me. Oh, shit. I mean, thankfully, you can see it pretty well. Achievement unlocked. Heightened reflexes.
Again? Again what? That'd be real subtle. Here's... Alright. Before we go any further. Let me say what I think happened in the story. Basically... Thomas here was part of the original three that came from Universe 4 with Jill whatever from Ajax News. And it was through the cracks that they showed up in that area where all the missing kids were. And then that's when the activation occurred and they were sucked into this universe or whatever. Thomas did some questionable things that traumatized them. And Jill died because of it. And that's where his amnesia comes from. And ever since then, he's been living in this universe that he does not belong Our in. Old apartment. Blah, 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 blah. You get it. Check the text message on the phone. Hey, Dr. Jackson. I just wanted to say your work on Darius was nothing short of phenomenal. That kid is going to have more than just a shot at a normal life now. Booking time with the Fraser Foundation ASAP. This should be good for years of grant money. <laughs> the ghost just said, hey. <laughs> What's up? Okay. Oh, here we go. Hey, honey. Hey, honey. Um, I want to go check out the house today. Looks like the uh, whole ordeal with the roof is finally over. Just one more reason for us to celebrate. I just wanted to let you know that I left to drop some things off at Abby's real quick. Wait for me to get back home, okay? I have more amazing news I want to talk to you about. Jill. Oh, that's nice. Look at, look at the smile. Oh, that doesn't, that doesn't look right. Zooming in. <laughs> it just like messes up the note. Whatever. Things nobody would notice unless they're me. Lighter. The horror engine staple. Not that. Bust out the lighter, dude. I don't know what the hotkey for it is. I need a key. Oh, here we go. I guess. Oh. Jeez, man. Ring. The time is now. I can feel it. Say yes. Say yes, please. I think I put the candles in the wardrobe. Uh oh, you mean where the demon is? Oh no. Get the candles from the wardrobe. Leave them on the cabinets and light them up. By the way, if this song is uh, copyright, I will never forgive you. I'm just saying that now. Cool. I don't know if we would want to do this exactly, considering it's just on cardboard. Am I missing something here? Is there a key or some shit that I'm not seeing? Um. Alright, I'll just light them up, I guess. Feels like one's missing. Now what? Leave them on the cabinets and light them up. What is this man talking about? There's a candle missing. What does that say? Oh no, it's just a shirt. <laughs> um. I thought it would just be here. 
Oh, look at me. Ah, okay. So this is how they get me to go back and forth. So that something can change. Or not? Beautiful. Where did I leave the flower box? There it is. Oh, that's uh, romantic. Another text message. Better check it out. One day I would like to leave rose petals all along the floor, all the way to a bathtub. Hey, hey baby, there's just too much traffic downtown. How about you meet me at Dave Shitty Dive? You know how much I love his open mic karaoke. Waiting for you there. Love you. Typical. Ruin my romantic evening. She seems so excited. Wonder what she's got up her sleeve. Find Jill at the pub. <laughs> that sounds funny. I don't think we'll get there, though. I don't think we'll be making it to any pub. How do I leave? Oh, fuck. Okay. Game saved. All right, hon. Drag me all the way out to be serenaded by Fat Tony's creative rendition of Hotel California. Must be something special. You're gonna ask him for an encore in a second here, trust me. <laughs> hey, Tommy. <laughs> Look. It's Thomas? I... I'm gonna be a father? <laughs> We're gonna have a baby! But how? You're scarring. I'm just as surprised as you. The, the doctors are stumped. It's not totally a miracle, but I'm pretty close. Holy fucking shit, babe. I... <laughs> All right. Dave is busting out the expensive shit. Everyone in the house is getting shots. Everyone. All right, Doc. Good thing you're not on call. Let's do another one, then hit the road. I gotta interview a kid in the morning that's making solar panels for halfway houses. Oh, Jesus. I need at least another one after hearing that. I swear to God. Sometimes these people are just made up. <laughs> I mean, I literally met you when you were wrist deep in an orphan's spine, giving him a chance to walk again. Yeah. But that's just work. No big deal. Oh, come on, don't do your self-deprecating crap now. You're the best man I've ever met. Thanks. Just wish I always felt that way. But I do when I'm with you. Aww. You're the best man I ever met. You know, you only do what psh, hundreds of thousands of surgeons all around the world do. But you, you're, you're different, Thomas. I don't like the texture on this wall. It just, uh, it's not, uh, is that a giant cockroach? What the fuck? Okay, no, it's just a tree. Oh, Thomas, what the fuck? Pull over! Ah, so that's what happened. I drank a little too much. So it's Gosh. as I said. <sighs> Jill? Jill? No. 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 Wake up. Please. 2021. Investigate this mysterious reality. Yes, sir. I kind of figured... I mean, it had to be, you know? It had to be that. That's the thing. I'll need a screwdriver to open it. Your hope is meaningless. You will never have... You will never have head? 
I wouldn't say never. That's fucked up. Okay. I can't open these? Guess not. You will never escape your mind. Delusion, 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 delusion. Oh, shit. <laughs> okay. Get me out of this crazy world. Oh, here we go. A huge rusty key. I want to see him up close. Oh, there it is, the screwdriver. <laughs> Might be useful. <laughs> Bitch. Achievement unlocked. Curious Pete. Pain is within me, but the truth of the eye is what fears me. Yeah, I'll turn in a second, but... Thomas, just... stop. I can't come back. You know, I was in a coma for a month. With a broken femur, a broken ankle, a severe concussion. And all of that would have been fine. But I lost my baby. My miracle child. My, my once-in-a-lifetime shot at being a mother. And I'm still hurting from that. You can't just keep drowning in guilt and booze. So don't call me if you can't call sober. Wow. A wheelchair, figure of a man, and a strange symbol. Okay. I think we're all done here. Game saved. These energy readings are off the charts. Literally. We'll have to invent new instruments just... Just to measure these insane power spikes. Granted, the mutated piles of flesh hell bent on destroying all life are an issue. But hey... All new breakthroughs are bound to come with a few hiccups. I can't wait to tell my wife Susan about this. With the money we'll make off of this, we'll be able to hire that Pilates instructor she's been talking about, Kyle Samuelson. Oh, Kyle. Trust me, you do not want that instructor in your life. Okay. Okay. I'm going to go out on a limb here and say that this creature has a reason to be here. That he is within the context. But what is that context? Who is he? What is he representing? Is it my, my pain? My inability to escape the mental prison that I've created for myself? My eternal regret? Locked up in a cage? I, uh... I don't... Oh, that looks cool. I just don't know what they are implying with these monsters. What was that? Find a way to turn off the power and fix the broken wires. That's what I was working on. Hey, the eye's back. Locker room. Another fucking code. Gorberg's calling for you. Okay. So I need to figure something out. The 
puzzle has started here. We have boxes. Oh, another door. I didn't even see this one. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Okay. Okay. What does this say? The mirror never sleeps. We already know that. But now we need the boxes. Do we need two? Yes, we do. Sorry, this probably hurts your eyes, but it hurts mine too. There we go. Ugh, my eyes, fuck. Oh no, please, no spiders. Oh my god, fuck. Damn, bro, you got beat up. Oh, dude, God just protected me because I looked down to see if this was a code, okay? God was on my side. He was like, nah, no spiders today, Lord. Not today. Man, I don't even know what to say. That's like perfect timing to miss a jump scare. It's always near you, watching you. Don't look in the abyss. Damn. Did you see it in the abyss? What is this? Okay, it's locked. So we need to come back to that later. Broken music box. There's writing in it saying, Alien streams lessen the hunger of the Mirror Forge. Alien streams? It's broken though, so we gotta fix it. I'll take the key. Hmm, maybe I should try the key on the crate near the vent back there. I should look around for the lever. Oh, let me guess. It's in the box. No fucking way. Now that the power's off, I guess I can fix the wires and go through the fence. This doesn't make any sense now that the power's off, but I'm not mad because I don't want to deal with it either. Okay. 80 per, almost 80% of the population vanished following the mysterious blue explosion. Unidentified dangerous beings roamed the streets. My mind's playing tricks with me. It seems that reality is fluctuating. Other worlds colliding with our own. I've read about a similar thing back home. About a foggy town in Maine. Tourists reported strange things happening on the streets after a supposed burning of a little girl by some cultist. A Silent Hill reference? A Silent Hill 1 reference. Are you kidding me? A foggy town in Maine. I guess you could say it was a quiet mound. Anything else? Achievement unlocked. Stay silent. Ugh. Way to nail it in. He, they, they were right when they said the Mirror Forge is a hammer. Okay, I guess we're going in there. That's the handshake. They just sealed the deal. I think this game looks really good, by the way. Sometimes. I think these uh, nightmare areas look really cool. Find a way to turn off the power and fix the broken wires.
Oh shit. Fucking awesome. I mean, if we're gonna break them, we're gonna break them all, right? So. They are losing hope. A man, man's dream the achievement unlocked. Broke their resolve. No one has had the metal to say anything to my face. I can hear them whispering. I see the cowards and their furtive glances. Weak-minded fools. Can they not see that we are on the precipice of greatness? When I activated the forge, it was beautiful. Golden vistas. Fathomless desire. Power without measure. They're so close to breaking through. I will not be denied. So close to breaking through to what, though? It makes very little sense, dude. This is all in the pursuit of endless energy? Am I right on that? What good is endless energy when everything is gone? Everything is just dead. So like that looks cool. The moving organs on the walls look cool. I've always been a sucker for giant industrial fans. Can't even lie. I guess we can't leave yet, so we're just gonna close that. We have to fix the... They, um, the wires, which are here. Cable has been something. Now to pull the lever and turn the power back on. Got it. Hold on, what's back here? Uh, we'll never know. Oh my god. Continue exploring the environment. They could have got me there, right? Why did they stop? Game saved. Locked for two days. No food, no water. I don't know what's real anymore. Strange. Things roam the hallways. Wait, it's not our hallways anymore. What am I thinking? My mind is getting numb. It looks like reality shatters around me. Multiple realities converging and changing what I see, what I hear, what I feel. There's something in the air. It plays tricks on me. My eyes sometimes see different realities. Some of them terrible and cold. Others seem like memories, fragmented of my tired mind. That's a, that's a lot of words to say a whole lot of nothing. What you guys got in here? I know I'll die locked in here. Going deeper into the facility is my only chance of survival. My keycard is just across the hall in my locker. Code 9173. So simple, but the monsters, I can't outrun them. My leg is fucked. If you're reading this, no, I didn't die a coward. 9173. Okay, and then he writes it down. 9173. Where was the locker? Oh, okay, I know where it is. It's over here. This is the moving organ I was telling you guys about. This looks this looks awesome. What is that eye looking at? Oh, that's, oh okay. That's kind of fucked up. <laughs> 9173. Hello? Jonas keycard. The only keycard left to open the electronic door. Okay. What door? Use Jonas's card to open the automatic door. What door? I'm assuming it's... Oh, it's this one. Oh, do they want me to go through the... The vents again? 
Or maybe it's not that door. Maybe it's like this one. No? Okay, so maybe they want me to go through the vents again. I don't think there was a door in here. I guess we'll go through the vents again. Oh, no, no. I can't go back. Um, is there a door in here? No? There's gotta be a fucking door somewhere. Uh, da, 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 da. Maybe there is a door in that maintenance room. Nope. Okay, so we're missing something. I mean, it says exit right there, man. I, I don't know. Let me in there. I must be missing something really obvious. What? Was this always here? I don't want to believe it. I don't want to believe that this was always here. Is this a Silent Hill 2 reference? Game saved. I'm surprised you got out of there alive looking at your injuries. And to think, he got out of it with just a broken hand. Bum, bum, bum. Not really a reveal, but... Okay. I see a fucking freakish monster over there. Explore the hospital. Okay, hold on. That means this is a whole new area. I think there's no audio at all. This game is completely silent right now. No atmosphere. There's no breeze. There's no lights. No mechanical anything. It's a hospital. There's no ambience. Zero right here right now but anyway that's besides the point i'm going to stop here so that i can give you guys a chance to watch it today because i know some of you are just getting off lunch actually or maybe some of you are getting back from school so i'll upload this and uh i'll see if i can finish it in the next part i actually don't have time believe it or not because it's fucking 12 on a tuesday and I'm an adult, so unfortunately, things to do. You know what I, you know, you know what it's like. Uh, but yeah, I'm glad we were able to get to a point where it'll be easy to come back to. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, consider subscribing. And uh, I'll catch you guys on the next one. Bye bye. Hopefully, this game still works when I come back. <laughs>